What's going on guys, Johnny here, back with more Shadowgun Legends. In today's video, we answer the question, how much fame does it take to unlock a full legendary weapon from scratch? I will do it on my True Patriot that I got here, it's pretty decent, and I started from scratch. Now, if you don't know already guys, the first two perks on a weapon are unlocked by dealing damage to enemies. And as you can see, my second perk is not unlocked yet, so I will go deal damage to unlock it. But then after that, the rest of the perks will be unlocked by gaining fame. You can compare with my Chronic Scream that I have here. The first two perks are already unlocked. And you can see the third perk at 74% says in the bottom, gain fame to unlock the next unique perk. Now before we start this, I make sure that all my equipped items that I have right now, the gear and the weapons, are already fully unlocked. Because if you're wearing multiple items that are not unlocked, the fame that you gain will be split among items that you're wearing. So my Nico is unlocked, my pistol is fully unlocked, and all the gear I have you can see is already 100% unlocked. So the only item I have on me right now that requires fame is a true patriot so let's go get some damage first and then we'll start working on the theme i often get the question how come i have so many dailies seriously every day i get the question it's because i don't claim the rewards i just finish them and i get two new missions every day but when i ever want to claim the rewards it's gonna give me a lot of fame 3750 per mission that i claim so that's how i'm gonna unlock my perks today but first let's go do some damage Unit to SG coming low and fast for a hostile extraction. Be ready, sir. Now let's check that true patriot because it's got the exclamation mark, uh, which you don't see, but let's check it out, okay? I just came back from a mission. I did gain a little bit of fame because, of course, I got ribbons and stuff, but it says 3% on the magazine cap perk. I will relog just to make sure all the fame registered and we see how we start. Now I'm back in the hub and we'll check the progress. It is still at 3% so we're good to start and I predict it's gonna be around 90,000 fame because I remember back then about a year ago, I think it's White Flower, he did the mat and he said it was 90,000 for a full legendary. So it's about 15,000 per perk for a total of 90. You guys can take notes also, I'm at 6,889 at the start. We're gonna go claim some rewards now. So if it's still 90,000, I should need about 25 boxes, 24 or something like that. I'm gonna start with 10, and that will be 10. So you see my fame at the top, it goes up every time I claim a box, 6,927 now. That's 37,000 fame, I guess. And look at all these boxes, that's gonna be fun to open. By the way, they changed their rewards in these things. And we now have the Explorer helmet, the loose cannon hat, Vanguard chest, a couple of cool items, and digital camo cans, that's pretty good. But the thing I want you guys to notice is my fame is still at 3% on the first perk. You need to relog to have the fame register. So let's relog and see the progression. Okay, I'm back, let's check the Patriot. And look at all the progression, that's sick. It's four full perks and a half, so that's way faster than I thought. 37,000 fame for four perks, so maybe the first couple perks unlock faster and the last perks will take more fame, or we were wrong and it's no longer 90,000 fame because that was 37,000 for four perks and a half. So let's grab maybe two more boxes and just see the difference. I'm at 32% on the second to last. So I did 12 boxes total today. Now we're gonna relog again. Back in the hub. I, I claim two boxes and the perk is not yet done. It's at 96%. So let's claim maybe uh, two more and see the progression on the last perk. And after the relog, I'm at 54% complete. So I think if I just get two more, I could be done. Let's see. And two, that could be the last one. And that is enough, guys. All the perks are now unlocked on my True Patriot. 
I needed to open 16 boxes. So let's do the match real quick. So 16 times 3,750 is 60,000 fame. So it's not 90,000, it's 60,000. But it's not divided equally. It's not 10,000 fame per perk because the last perk took me about four boxes. So I guess there's a progression there. But guys, uh, check my fame right now and the fame I had before I started. Uh, and you can count the 3% on the first perk, but it doesn't really matter. It is 60,000 fame, guys. And uh, no longer 90 or maybe we were wrong a while ago. Maybe they changed. I don't know. I hope you guys can confirm if you ever start unlocking a new legendary, do what I did. Make sure you have nothing else to unlock. Check how much fame you got at the start. Check how much fame you got at the end. And please confirm. Come back in the video and confirm in the comment because it would be nice for the community to like be sure about the numbers. But I have 60,000 right now. And guys, we're not done. Don't leave. We're about to open all these boxes. And hopefully I can get the Explorer helmet. It's only 6% chance to get a common. And there's two different commons in there. But I would like the Explorer helmet because it was one of my first ever cosmetic in the game. When I started the game a year ago, I opened my strong boxes and I got the army hat and the Explorer hat. And you will open the strong box. Here you go. We got a GI Exchanger. It's steampunk controls. It's an epic. It's purple. So that's... Uh, a higher rarity than the one I had before and it's an explorer helmet this one's more common but it looks pretty cool and I had to sell it because of inventory problems down the road but I kind of miss it and I never bought it back so if we can get explorer hat today it will be a great day let's go and start opening these things I got 16 to open so we have a shot and we start with a sticker the punk sticker Box number two is Redshift. Number three, Loose Cannon, our first hat today. Next one is Tiger. And I just remember why I see so many people wearing the Loose Cannon hat these days. And the post on Facebook and Discord. Because it's in the daily rewards, right? And by the way, if you guys didn't see on the last mad stream, uh, Marek said they want to increase the rewards for daily missions. Because they think people don't do their dailies that much. So I cannot wait to see. Maybe I should keep my boxes now for when they increase the rewards. Or if they change it at least. Oh, there you go. Explorer hat. That's freaking awesome. This thing rocks. Let's wear it right now. Dude. Bro, it reminds me so much of Halo for a reason. If you guys ever played Halo 3 ODST? I don't know, man. I just have a feeling. Oh, dude. That thing rocks. So let's open the rest still. Got redshift. I'm getting a lot of redshift, and this paint also is awesome. If you have redshift and lion skin camo or gold, uh, that's what um, Bags used for his Iron Man suit, and that's what I used for my rabbit a couple months ago. It's really nice. Samurai sticker. Digital camo. That one is also pretty cool. One more, and we got four more boxes. Loose cannon again, look at that. One, two, three, plus the old one. Bro, that's a lot, I'm not gonna keep that, you know. Duplicate cosmetics, no use for that. An army green, two more. Tiger. Please, the stickers stack. And Vanguard chest. I think I have it though. Yeah, I have it. Is it the one? Yeah, Vanguard chest front. Vanguard chest front. It's the same. But that's also a nice one, by the way. Some guys been asking on Facebook this week where you get the Vanguard chest. Well, it's in the boxes now. So do your dailies, guys. And grab the fame, grab the rewards because it's there. Uh, but yeah, you can also stack them. I got down to 87 now, but I think I'm gonna start stacking them again for later. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like if you did. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more Shadowgun Legends news, gameplay, and guys, I will be back soon. Till then, watch my other videos. Take care.